Hey there, my name is Jake Panasevich, and this is a 10 minute hamstring opening sequence. I'm going to start at the top of your mat, feet hips width apart, about two fists width apart, feet straight forward, bow forward, bend your knees enough to touch the floor and clear your back. Okay, so far as you could keep that release in your low back, you could start to stretch your legs as straight as they'll go. And inhale, lift halfway up, hands to the floor to your shins, and exhale, bow. Twice more like that. Get tall enough to feel an extension in your spine. And exhale, fold. Okay, once more, inhale. Exhale, place your hand, step back for down dog. Adho Mukha Swanasana. Okay, feet and your hips width apart. Feet straight forward. Look at your feet. Make sure they're aligned. Bend both knees enough to get a lordotic curve in the low back. And only so far as you could keep that release in the low back, you can start to stretch the backs of your legs as straight as they'll go. And inhale, come forward for plank. Exhale, low plank. Lower your hips for a cobra. Point your feet. Bend your elbows enough to keep your shoulders back. And exhale, down dog. Inhale, come to the balls of your feet. Exhale, bend your knees, look forward. Step or hop to the front. Feet hips width apart. Lift halfway up. Hands on your hips, shoulders back. Come up and stand. Okay, weight in your right foot. Step your left foot back for pyramid pose. Okay, it's a short enough stance, both heels are rooted. Okay, you twist over your right leg, fold over that right leg, hands on either side of your right foot to the floor of the blocks. Okay, if you can't quite touch the floor, bend your right knee as much as you have to, to touch down. There's a little twist over that right leg in the asymmetrical quality of the pose. You bow over the front leg. And step forward and switch sides. Weight in the left foot, right foot back for pyramid. Come on up. Square your hips to the front. And your back foot angles towards the upper right corner of the room to help square your hips. Bow over your left leg. Hands to either side of your left foot to the floor of the blocks. Again, if you don't have blocks, bend your left knee as much as you need to to touch down. But you're actively stretching your legs out. And inhale, step it forward, bow at the top. Inhale, weight in your right foot. Step your left foot way back. Spin both feet towards the wide edge of your mat. Feet even with one another. Feet straight forward and bow forward. Bend your knees enough to clear your back and touch. So far as your low back feels release and straighten your legs out as straight as they'll go. Inhale, lift halfway up. Turn your right foot towards the front edge of your mat. Frame out your right foot with your hands. Step back, down dog. Inhale, plank. Legs strong for low plank. Keep your shoulders lifted, lower your hips for cobra. And exhale, down dog. Inhale, step your right foot forward between your hands for a low lunge. Lower your back knee gently and straighten your right leg out for half split. Okay, adjust your stance so you're long enough. Your left knee is slightly behind your left hip. Hands on either side of your right shin to the floor or blocks. If you don't have blocks, bend your right knee as much as you have to to touch. And most importantly, keep your right toes flicked up towards you. Okay. And from here, you're going to turn your right foot to the left just slightly at the same rate your right knee turns left. Your whole right thigh rotates in its hip socket to the left at the same rate. Okay, just slightly, like an inch. Come back to center. Second side, it's like flossing for your hamstrings. 
So your right foot turns right, the same rate your knee turns, your thigh turns. And come on back to center. And place both hands to the inside of your right foot, slide it back for down dog. Second side, inhale, step your left foot between your hands, lower your back knee super gently. You can pat up the knee if you need. And straighten your left leg for half split. Okay, adjust as you need so that when you point your left toe straight up, the second toe of your left foot points straight up, even with the center of your left kneecap, even with the center of your left hip crest. So you stretch all three hamstrings evenly. Hands to either side of your left shin, to the floor or blocks, or you can even bend your knee if you need. Just keep the foot engaged to protect your hamstring attachment. And turn your left foot, rotate it right just an inch. Okay, at the same time, your knee rotates right, your whole thigh rotates right at the same rate. Okay, important to keep these toes flicked up, foot engaged as you do this. So come back to center, just a subtle turn in your whole leg, okay? So get the medial lateral hamstrings. And bring it back to center. Place both hands to the inside of your left foot. Slide it back. Whew. Down dog. Inhale plank. Leg straight for low plank. Hips to the floor for cobra. Let's do a little back bend in between all those hamstring stretches. And down dog. Just feel the difference in the first one you did. And lower down to sit. And swing your legs out. And, and stretch your right leg out, left knee in. For Janu Shirsasana, twist to the right. Reach your left hand for your right foot or shin, whatever you could get. Root your right leg down, twist right as you bow. And second side, reach your left leg out. Bend your right knee in. Twist to the left, reach your right hand for your left foot or lay, whatever you could reach. More importantly, flick the toes up. Root your left leg down to help create a lift out of your low back on the left side. And come on up, both legs out wide. Toes point up, knees point up, hands behind you, tip your pelvis up. Low back lifts. Okay, only so much as you could keep your legs rooted and your low back lifted. You start to fold down the middle. Okay, if, if you go to come forward, if you feel your knees lift up, if you feel your back slouch under, okay, hands behind you and root your legs down as straight as they'll go. And come on up. And your legs <laughs> might feel very stretched out after all those hamstring stretches. Hope you enjoyed. My name's Jake Panasevich. Thanks for joining me today. Namaste.